Hi everyone. This past few days has been very challenging for me. I'm in the midst of getting the servers, that is the computers, installed, set up, and ready so that we can grow into a community and offer more support to each other. The past few days hasn't gone well. There's been a few hiccups that I've been having to work through. And so many of the techniques I've shared in previous videos is what I've been using to deal with the stress and the disappointment that the first few steps haven't gone well. So I say this to let you know that I'm not above what I share with you. It's the skills and the very practical stuff that I go to when I'm dealing with the own challenges in my life. Ironically, what I've often said here has happened again this evening. You don't have to look hard to find encouraging things that have happened to you and motivation to keep pressing forward. I went to the pool this evening to do my normal routine and when I was in the pool I had a wonderful time playing ball with a girl where the parents were preoccupied with the two younger children. The girl was in the deeper water with me while I was doing my exercises and you know we just had sort of a beach type ball that we passed back and forth. It helps me a lot sort of be focused on the child while I'm doing my exercises because of the amount of pain that it creates. If I'm able to focus on here then I'm not so much dealing with what's going on inside of my body so that I can get the maximum gains out of the exercise and the routine. Just as I was starting to think about getting out of the pool, there was a little knock at the observation window. It was a boy around seven or eight years old that had a little candy, kind of what you'd suck on, and he pointed it and motioned that he wanted to give it to me. About 10 minutes later, the two brothers and the dad arrived in the pool area, and the boys got in to spend some time swimming, and the dad explained to me that the boys expected that I was gonna be in the pool tonight and they had a whole big argument at their home over what would be the right flavor for me to enjoy of a candy. I've seen this happen a few times now. It's the children showing appreciation for having spent time with them. And, you know, it's rewarding. So they wanted to play with the balls and the rings for a few minutes. You know, and I know young children, the very youngest was ready to move on after about 10 minutes, and the older one was ready after about 20 minutes. And at that point, I was quite ready to get out of the pool myself from getting cold. But it went really well. There was a further rewarding time this evening waiting for me. One of the youth was wanting to speak to me about some stuff going on in his life. They all know that they can come talk to me about anything and I'll treat them with respect and listen. And at the end, he had commented that he sees me more of a father figure than his biological father. It's really encouraging seeing these relationships grow and develop. They challenge me just as much as I challenge them in pursuing their lives and working out their identity. Anyway, it's been a good night after 
and frustrating week, and I wanted to share it with you. I hope each of you are doing okay. Have a wonderful day. Bye for now.